been so crazy for me. I can't afford anything right now. I can't afford these bills. I can't afford these kids. I can barely afford myself. Oh my God, I'm so hungry right now, man. It's like my stomach is growling every 10 seconds. Like, Mommy, can you get something to eat? I'm hungry. You don't think I'm hungry too? I live here with you. There's nothing to eat for you or for me. And I understand that. But I have a lot going on right now. Like I could barely feed myself. Look at my hair. I don't have any help. Are you sure there's nothing you can figure out to make in there? I'm tired of this life. Let me see what I can do. Let me see if there's anything. Oh, wow, there really isn't nothing but a stick of butter and milk. Oh my gosh. What am I going to do with these kids? Sorry, man. There's nothing to eat in the refrigerator. I guess we're going to do another night of no food. Is there water? Is there water? There's milk. You want to do another night of just milk? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that this is our life, but it's just, I don't have enough right now. I'm really trying to see if I can find another job so I can plug in more hours so that we can afford it. I mean, I have Omari, I have Ozzy, I have three of you guys to worry about. I don't even know where, where's your dad right now. He still hasn't called. I'm so sorry. Look at this, bills, 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 bills. All these final notices. I can't believe this is my life. Mom, what's wrong? Are you okay? I'm not okay. It's like everything is crumbling down on me. Your brothers are hungry. I have nothing but bills sitting here. I'm just done with this. I hate my life. Oh, uh, you know, Mom, I have some birthday money that I still have. I can, you know, buy Amari ate some snacks. Really, Archie? Yeah, I would, I would do that. I'm so sorry for just, you know, taking my anger out on you. Mom, it's okay, I understand. You know, you're stressed. But I'm here to help you, alright, Mom? Okay, I guess. I mean, you and your brothers, go get, go get your shoes. Aiden, come. Just go put your shoes on. Go get your stuff together. Get Amari together. Ozzy said, said he'll cover your snacks today. At least he'll have something to eat today at the gas station. I love you guys. Come on, Amari. Look at this. The lottery. Hey, then, don't even worry about it, bro. Nobody ever wins this. It's always somebody in like Idaho or Iowa. What are the chances we might win? 27. Slim to none. No one ever wins in Miami. You never know. Look at this, I bet no one wins. 47. Whatever. Losers! Losers! And the is 19. Boy, put your shoes on, we gotta go. Mom did say she was hungry. Wow. I wonder if I can play the lottery right now. What are my chances that I would win this? Let me see what he says. Hi, excuse me. How much is it to play the lottery? Uh, what are the prices? One. Well, two. Okay, the little Florida lottery thing? Try my luck. Okay.
Alright, let's see if I win this. I don't believe I will, but whatever. Hold on, wait, wait a minute. No way, no way. got rid of these kids i cannot wait to get on with my new life y'all i'm a billionaire oh my gosh the kids are with their grandmothers life is about to be amazing my airport i'm about to go into my mansion you guys i'll be back let's see these kids are calling me hello why are you calling me you're with your grandma your dad is coming for you soon. You'll be fine, trust me. Bye. Oh my gosh. Look at my beautiful home. I have finally arrived. No kids, no man. I'm a millionaire. Look at this. Just look. My new life. <laughs> These kids, why do they keep calling me? Can't they see I'm just living my life without them? I have all this space. Maybe kind of lonely. I don't hear Amari. I don't hear Aiden. Maybe this wasn't a good idea. You know what? What's money when you don't have anybody to spend it on? You don't have anybody to share it with. I thought this is what I wanted, but maybe family is what I really need. What's a house if it can't become a home? Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see my neighbor. I have so much to tell her. Hello, neighbor. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Hi, neighbor. I'm doing hey, good. Yourself. How are you doing? Oh my gosh, girl. I What's got so much on? to tell you. Child. How are you liking your new house? I love it. But I know. Like the pictures are beautiful. Oh my gosh, girl. It, my life changed when I won so much money, girl. It was like I I can definitely imagine, girl. Like, but I have some things that's been on my mind. What's going on? It's been just sitting on my heart. I don't know. Can we just talk outside? Yeah, come on. Okay. It's kind of noisy out here. Yeah, it is. Sorry, girl. They're doing construction in the area. So what's going on, girl? What what happened? It's a lot. Like, 
I really thought I wanted this move and everything like that. I thought I wanted to get rid of my kids. Get rid of them. And my husband. I left them. No. Why I, would you do that? I wanted a new life and I thought that's what the money was for. I thought like with the money I can just buy happiness. No, and money does not buy happiness. I'm not finding it. that out now right now because I miss my babies. First of all, with all that money, like what? You are just going to spend it all on yourself? Like what's money if you can't enjoy it with your husband and your kids i don't like know your family like i just thought i was gonna just be going on vacations and like laying on a yacht in san tropez that, by yourself that, this was my vision like girls all that stuff like girls trips and stuff like that but the house just feels so lonely like i don't have anyone to talk to i don't hear amari running through the halls i don't hear ozzy just throwing balls inside it's just so depressing yeah you should definitely get back to your family it, like, no, you cannot leave them. You cannot abandon your family. Yeah, I mean, I see people do it all the time on TV once they make money, but that's not for me, man. I miss my husband. I miss everyone. It's like, how did you do it? Like, how did you just up and leave? Like, How did I do it? Yeah, like, how did you just up and cross states and stuff like that with no problem? Like, you left your family. Yeah, but it was different. It wasn't for money. It was, you know, to purchase a home. And yeah. to, you know, better myself and to, you know, have a better environment. It wasn't, like, I wasn't doing it selfishly. I mean, I got my new home also. I got my mansion. What am I supposed to do with the house now? Yeah, but I came with my child. You left your ch your kids and your husband. And they've been ringing. You can't do that. They've been ringing my phone all day. Like, i just been, like, ignoring them. Why would you ignore them? I don't know how to face them. Okay, first of all, it's okay if. If you're, you know, feeling down, that's okay. But you need to pick yourself back up, mm -hmm. okay? You need to call your kids, call your husband, and you need to get back with them. Because, no. I'm not even wearing my ring anymore. What? I, I really thought I was going to find me this millionaire boyfriend. No, like, no. All I got is this leech trying to stay at my house. I went on a date the other day, and this guy. You're cheating on your husband. I left him. I went on a date and this guy was trying to move in. He's trying to leech off me. I'm like, dang, like my husband would have never done that, you know? Absolutely. So you need to share your wealth with your family, with the yeah. people who actually care for you and not just trying to take advantage of you. That's what I'm seeing now, girl. Thank you so much. I need that insight. Like, I just thought I knew better, but I'm, I'm really about to go back home to my kids and my husband. I just miss them so much. Like, yeah. I'm just going to yeah, sell you the house. Yeah. I don't know what to do. Should yeah. I sell the house? I think you should definitely go back to your family. Girl, thank you, doll. Like, y'all know how I was feeling at home alone. Like, it's depressing. All I hear is silence. Like, it was driving me crazy. But I thank you so much for your advice. I think I'm going to go home to my family. Absolutely. Thank you, Sally. You're welcome. <laughs> let me call my kids and let them know mommy's coming home. Yes. <laughs> I'm sure they'll be so excited. Oh, my gosh. Hello? Aiden? Guess what? I'm coming back, baby. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous. I'm finally here to see my kids and I just really hope they could forgive me. They could find it in their heart to accept me back into this family after I just left them once I got rich. Like, just look at them. They're playing around and laughing. They actually look happy without me. I wonder if they even missed me. <sighs> All right then, here goes nothing. Hello? Wait, wait. Mom? Wait, you're back? How is this possible? I thought you were going to leave us forever. Yeah, that's what I thought too. Um, I mean, I'm back, you guys. I just, I miss you guys so much. Can I get a hug? I'm not, well, I'm not too sure about a hug right now. You left us for the money that you won at the lottery. I'm sorry, you guys. Like, I really, I really, really thought, like, money was everything, and I learned the hard way that money is not. Come on, let's have a seat. Let's catch up. Come on. Hey, Mari, Hi, Mari. Poppy. Amari. Hi. Y'all. Oh, my gosh. Y'all should have seen my life. Like, I literally flew to Houston. I bought a mansion. But, y'all, like, I really missed you guys. Like, I really learned that money wasn't everything because money is nothing without family and without love. The room was empty. The house was so quiet. I was like, ah, oh, like, I, I missed your noise and your 
craziness and the house being a mess. It was so clean every day. Like, I'm so sorry, you guys. Like, I really had to learn my lesson. Yeah. It's okay, and well, since you and dad were married, some of the money went to him too. Really? Yeah, we had a blast. We went to Disney World, Aquatica. We went on a shopping supreme. We went to the movies. We did all of those cool things. It was so we fun. We went to Legoland, Orlando Resort. We were living our life. Well, we also went to California. You guys did all that while I was gone? Yeah. Well, why didn't you guys call me? Because you just picked your bags up and just left us. I really missed all that, all the memories, all the fun you guys had, all because of my greed. But just promise me, you'll never do something like that again. I won't, but I actually still have some money. So what do you guys want to do now? Mm. How about we go to Nickelodeon Resort? Wait, can we get ice cream to celebrate? Of course. Is that even a question? What else do you guys want? Um, you want Nike text? Nike text? Y'all want Ithaca's? Yes. Y'all want to go to... Atlanta for the good food! Yes! yes! We're so happy to have you back, Mom. We missed you. I miss you guys so much. Oh my God, I love my boys. I love my family. You guys are the best. Money is nothing without you guys. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for forgiving me. I'm so sorry. I'll never do that again. It's okay, Mom.